Okay, hey good morning, people. So it's eight o'clock in the morning, and it's red as the beautiful morning. So we can't just sit around and then doing nothing. So yeah. we have to do something today. Yeah. So the, what is the plan today, Charlie? We're going to go find a beach. Yes. We haven't been able to go out for a few weeks because we've had some kids to take yes, care yes, of. Yes. Um, we haven't been very far on our bike. We've just kind of been hanging around. So this is the longest trip yes. Rosita will have been on. So hopefully yes. she behaves herself. Yes. So yeah, so, it's super fun. Okay, now we got a flat tire. Look at this. Oh, damn it. So we've got our flat tire and we're going very, very slowly back to find a Ben cow, which is a little mechanic. Luckily in Sumatra, there's Ben cows everywhere, so we shouldn't have to drive for too long before we find one. And we'll get some air pumped in our tire and get a fix and then go back to the beach. Oh dear, it is very flat. Very flat tire. Funnily enough, this is the exact same mechanic that we came to like five years ago. Seven years ago, seven years one ago, of the first times we were road tripping around here, we got a I flat know. tire. I and I remember we almost the same place, probably. Yeah, I think it's the same place. And we had to drive back and find the Ben Cowan, yeah. this is the same one. 45. We, uh, yeah, we, so we changed the new tire rather than cover it up. So. That's 45,000, which is around. That's the only It's New Zealand. Very quick service. Yes. Get up on your feet, this is a shake. We made it. Alright, so right now we're in the beach on the lake. Yeah. Uh, the name of this beach is Jibulaji. Yeah. So it took us around 30 minutes, I think, driving from our house, our home in Tuk Tuk. Yeah. About 25 minutes. 25. And then we add 10 minutes for our flat tire. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> So the lady at this little warung behind us came and told us it's 5,000 rupiah per person for, for, entry. for entry to the beach area. Yes. So that's about 50 cents. Yes. And it looks really pretty. There's no one else here really. There's another tourist over yeah. here. Over here, looks like a camping area, but I think this is more where locals might come yes, on the weekend yes, and set up yes. some tents and have a bit of a yes, camp out. Yes, yes, yes. yes. Not bad. It's nice if you want a day yes. blazing in the sun. You don't have a pool at your hotel. I know. You can't have access to the lake, and you want to come somewhere quite nice and private. I like yeah. it. Yes. Okay, so I got the tips for you guys. If you like a quiet place to swim, so do not come in weekend Italy because because this looks like it's gonna be busy in weekend for local. I think Italy, yeah? mm. clean white sand, nice. yeah. It's cool enough to be refreshing, but like quite warm. Yeah. Okay, for sure we're not gonna swim today because we don't feel like swimming. But it's such a nice beautiful day today for sunbathing and we probably have sunbathing for a while yeah, for 30 minutes okay it's really nice for like me if you know i'm introverted and yeah. i don't like a lot of attention yeah and i've been before to a different beach Paseo Puti, which would take you to sometimes yes and that's really always full of people and you get stared at quite a lot so yeah. if you really want to go to a beach but you don't want all that attention this is a really yes. cool place to go at yes. least during the week anyway. yeah Alright, so we just finished filming here, uh, finished flying my drone, finished taking Charlie's feet in the water. <laughs> so next, what next, Charlie? Well, we've had enough of sunbathing here, but we do hear there's another nice beach maybe 10 minutes further on. So yes. we're going to go find that one and see what it's like. Yes, and then there's a couple more beach here. Uh, uh, beach, I mean, sorry. So a bit further over there, they say there is beach as well, but I don't know if we're going to go there or not. But so far, I like this, this beach. Yes, yes. So yeah, see you there. little note if you do head out to Sibilazi Beach you'll be passing through Simonindo and you might want to stop here at the Museum Museum Hutabolo. Hutabolo. At Museum Hutabolo. Hutabolo. They have some really cool um, artifacts and history.
history of Batak and they do Batak dance and things yes, like that. So yes, yes. you can make that part of your day trip. Yeah. And I think we're only a few minutes away from, from where we're going, Subalazi Beach. Yes. Okay, so we tried to go to Batuhoda Beach, which is a really popular place for, I think, local tourists, and there's all sorts of attractions and stuff there, but it's 20,000 per person for, uh, entry and that's not within our budget today <laughs> we're a bit tight anyway we wouldn't stay long so it's not worth it so we're gonna head back towards home and maybe stop off for something to eat we've just stopped off at the most serene beautiful place on the way back we're at the buddha cafe and it's absolutely gorgeous we'll show you the garden in a minute it's a hundred percent vegan vegetarian restaurant right on the edge of the lake and it's probably about 10 minutes drive outside of Tuk Tuk so not too far at all yeah. and they make a homemade ice cream so I just ordered my ice cream and probably it's already finished there yeah. yeah nice menu of local food yeah. rendang but we haven't tried the food yet we're not yes. hungry but we do need some yeah. ice cream yes. but yeah yes. gorgeous spot I know. definitely recommend coming here just stopped off on this little place on the way home that I spotted on Google Maps. It's called Batu Pasa. You can see behind us beautiful tree with some rocks. Yeah. And then down here you can see there's a bit of a cave. Yes. And also a very peaceful and beautiful spot. Okay, once again we're not going to swimming again because for some reason, but... Uh, I don't want a wet bum on the motorbike. <laughs> That's what, <fine>. yeah. <laughs> and yeah, it's such a nice view over here to be honest. And then these dogs keep following us. Are you gonna name him something? Yeah. <laughs> no. Moppy. Moppy. Yeah. Alright, so we're tired and we're hot and we're hungry. So, but is we have a big, beautiful day, isn't it? Yeah, we did. And if you want to see other adventure we had on our scooter in Somerset, you can check the video out here. Yes, yes somewhere up there. <laughs> Around here. And see the... you next week. Yeah. See you guys. Woohoo!